any individual that has a spare car sitting in the driveway can post their car to our marketplace. And then on the other side, you have gig economy workforce, Uber, Lyft, Postmates, Instacart drivers that need a vehicle. Um, they come to the marketplace and rent that car. So rather than my car sitting in my driveway eight or nine hours a day while I'm at the office and I took the train in anyway, I could be making money from that. Absolutely. It's a depreciating asset. It's sitting in your, in your driveway. Um, so you're an individual with one extra car, post that on the marketplace. If you're a dealership and you have 10, 20, 50, 50% of your inventory that you want to dedicate to mobility as a service. Um, we're finding that a lot of institutional dealers are doing that as well. I'm here with Mike. He's the chief business development officer for a company called Hire Car. And I'm really excited about this company because it's kind of flipping the model of Uber and Lyft and making that work for people who own a car who want to hire their car out. Tell us about how this company got started. So it's really simple. We, uh, we had actually a car sitting in the driveway, uh, exactly as you, as you say. Um, it was wasting money. Uh, so we did a quick Google search, how do I rent my car to an Uber driver? Found out that there was this company, Hire Car in LA. Uh, we started to post the car to the marketplace. Uh, as, soon as, as soon as we posted the car, we got a hit, um, handed the keys over to the driver. Everything was done seamlessly uh, through the Hire Car platform. Um, the driver drove away. He turned on the Uber app and started working, which made him extend the rental for longer and longer periods of time. Uh, payment processing, insurance contracts were automatically generated through the Hire Car app. Um, so we saw this is a very viable business model. We uh, quit our day jobs and jumped in full, full time to help build the company. Um, now, it's been a few years now, and after about two and a half years, you guys have already done an IPO. Uh, what's the adoption rate so far? Where are you with how many people are using the platform? So currently, there's anywhere from five to 6,000 vehicles available in the marketplace. Um, you know, active drivers on the marketplace. We have hundreds of thousands of people that are visiting the site looking for this type of service. You had to create a new kind of insurance product. This is a new uh, area. So you worked with, I believe it was AIG on a special pro uh, product. So Absolutely. tell us a little bit about how that works. Absolutely. So AIG is the number one taxi and limo insurance company in the country. They um, you know, so all we do is is we created an, an insure tech product. So as soon as the car is it's sitting in the individual's driveway, <clears throat> it's covered under the individual's insurance policy. As soon as that car is rolled on Hire Car platform, it's covered by Hire Car's policy. Uh, now that Uber and Lyft driver turns the Uber and the Lyft app on, they're covered by Uber and Lyft. Uh, they turn the Uber and Lyft app off. Now they're back on Hire Car. So it's that kind of insure tech. Um, automatically toggling of liability from one period to the other is essentially Hire Car's product, if you will. If I have a car on Hire Car, what would be my expected return and how much time would I have to be loaning that car out in order to make that return? So car owners typically on Hire Car are making anywhere from that $900 to $1,100 per month per car. Well, there you have it. Mike from Hire Car, very interesting app. It's allowing people to rent out their cars to Uber and Lyft drivers. Why leave it sitting in the driveway when you could be making money from it? Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Great Appreciate to meet you. Likewise.